This is the kinder class, and the name of our play is Shall I Give You a Hat? A Christmas Yarn. And the author of the book is Kate 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 Lies. So animals, you can go back. One, two, three. Oh dear, oh my, oh goodness me. These were some of the things Mother Rabbit said when she heard the news. And Father Rabbit was worried too. He told the little rabbits, A blizzard is moving this way. Mother and Father Rabbit tied scarves onto their little rabbits. As they told them, Start snowing on Christmas Eve, <coughs> and it won't stop until it gets to the tippy top of your ears. Our uh, ears! That will be very cold! Mother Rabbit shook her head and answered, Yes! Shall I knit you hats to keep your ears warm? Yes! Please! A Christmas hat just for me. And me. And me. And me. And me. And so, when the little rabbit for school, mother and father rabbit knit and curl. Click, click, clack. The little rabbits came home from school. <clears throat> that evening, mother and father rabbit tried the hats on the little rabbits. They sat very still as their parents made the necessary adjustments. The little rabbits loved their new hats and wore them even when they ate dinner. During dessert, they thought of something and they asked Mother Rabbit, What about our friends? Should we make hats for them too? We could give them Christmas presents. Mother Rabbit loved that idea and she answered, Little rabbits, that idea is so sweet that you deserve another piece of carrot cake. The rabbits were very excited about the second piece of cake and finished it very quickly. They were also very excited about knitting hats for their friends. visited the horse. Mother Rabbit measures horse's mane while the little rabbits distracted him with a dance. Why were you doing a dance? Next, they visited Hedgehog, whose head they measured without getting poked. 
What are you doing back there? <laughs> they found their other friends downtown. The little rabbits told them a story while mother and father rabbits secretly took measurements. The rabbits were tired. They made their way home. They made their way home and got dinner ready. When they were eating dinner, they thought about their day. We were a little sneaky, the way we measured everyone. Sneaky, yes. Sneaky, yes, but necessary. The little rabbits cleaned up their dinner and got ready for a very busy night of midnight. Mother and father rabbit let the little rabbit stay up very late that night, two hours past their bedtime, so they could help with the hats. The hat ideas were all theirs. The cats? The cat's hat must be smart and stylish, just like she is. The hedgehogs? The hedgehog's hat will be soft because he is so pointy. The horses? The horse sat must be five legs like so he can sleep in the snow. The dogs? The dog sat must have an extra long tail that it looks pretty when it blows in the wind. The deers? The deers hat was so off her lovely antlers. The next day was Christmas Eve. Late in the afternoon, the rabbits pulled the gifts into town and slept. And the rabbits asked that all their friends gathered around to open the beautifully wrapped gifts. And the deer wondered, My, my, what do we have here? The rabbits explained, Open your friends! some of the things the friend said when the snow began to fall and fall and fall. As it got colder, the animals began to appreciate their hats. Look how this clever hat keeps my head warm and dry. The hedgehog? This hat is soft and comfortable. The my antlers have, nev have never been drier. The dog? My tail is in the wind, the wind blows in the wind. No. <laughs> <laughs> then the horse thought, Hey, we can catch up to the rabbits. We can thank them. The animal friends caught up to the rabbits and said, Thanks for the hat. We, we love, love them. them. Bye. 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 But then on the snowy sled ride home, the little rabbits had a terrible fox. Oh no, tomorrow is Christmas. And we haven't made anything for you, Mother. Or, or for, for you, you Father. Father. Little rabbits being with you, all of you, is the best Christmas present of all. Once they were safely home, the rabbits celebrated Christmas Eve with a carrot cake warm from the oven. They had three pieces each.